Yep. Hey everybody, welcome back to Jerry's Live. We are here at Art of the Carolinas. I am in the middle of the trade show right now. Uh, you got a little sneak peek of that yesterday before everything was set up. Uh, earlier today, Mike and I were out visiting the workshops. We saw Joe DiGiulio and Bob Burridge. Uh, those were a lot of fun. You can see the people kind of, you know, the trade shows part of it, the classrooms are the other part. They're a lot of fun. They're a great way to learn things, meet new people, uh, get some great experience. Bob Burridge said you learn more in three hours than most artists know in a lifetime. So uh, they are definitely worthwhile. This is kind of the main event. This is the trade show floor. I'm in the middle of frames and canvases. Christina, if you want to do a quick 360 view. You can see it is crazy. There is so much stuff here. There's so much stuff to do. We are filming live. Do you need to cut through? Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so while we're here, we are going to go walk around a little bit and see some of the demos that take place. So it's not just shopping. We have people that are out here showing you what the products do. You can get to try them for yourself. So if you're not sure about you know this product or this product, you get hands-on experience. So we're gonna go find Amy Gardner-Dean and see what she's demoing. So let's go take a look. Frames, canvases, paints on the wall. So Amy's over here. We're gonna go see, she's demoing Charvin right now, I believe. Hello, Miss Amy Gardner Dean. Two of my favorite people. <laughs> so we came by to see what you were demoing, and maybe we, we can get a little sneak peek. Too. That would be perfect. All right, I'll let you get say, back to it. Say say hi to your Providence Rhode Island peeps. Yeah. Hi guys. As um, the manager of the Providence store, and the official and sign of the line. line starts. You are the line and the line. Yeah, the, the line, start line starts here. Or start of the, well, it depends on how you want yeah, to spin right. that. Yes. yes. All right, well, so we've got a huge wall of Charvin all the way from the acrylics on down to oils, on down to fine oils. So we've got the entire spectrum of not all the colors they offer, but it darn looks like it, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Yeah, so we've got... With different brands, we've got demo booths. So what I've been doing here is people are always saying, what's the difference between the fine oils and the extra fine oils? So we actually put them out yes. and they get to see for themselves. Yes, I said it's very hands-on. So it's if somebody wants to grab a brush or a palette knife, well, do it themselves. Okay, so, right? so this is an interesting thing that one of the ladies did. And she uses Sennelier, mm -hmm. right? So what she wanted to do is she said, well, you know, these colors are beautiful, but what is the actual pigment load? What's the intensity? And so we talked about it. And so she took little tiny bits of white and barely just would like dip the brush in like this, pick out a little orange and then mix it with the white. That was how saturated that wow. was. So it shows you what a very slight amount of a very bright, you know, paint like this because it's so saturated with pigment that it made this, you know, very kind of beautiful tangerine color. Yes. With little to no, and she just like kept stopping and looking at me going, and I was really? like, is this good? Is yes. this bad? Because she wouldn't say anything. And then she's just like, I can't believe this. This is so saturated. Yes. So she is going to get her list and coming back and buying <laughs> like literally everything. So that is like the proof is in the pudding when you've got yes. somebody that uses another high-end paint like that then they try this and they're you know they're suitably impressed yes. yes so yeah so it's it's that's really awesome and then you know we talk about the differences between the two mm -hmm. and you know where one may be better than the other for you it's yeah. just it's been a lot of fun and even though we're testing out sharpened paints it's not just sharpened you can test out we've got some solvents different yes. brushes uh some panels a little yeah. bit of everything you need to paint in your own. Yeah, it's well, and and it's like that kind of all across the board. There's there's Turner. There's uh, security. Hey, security. I know. Look who it is. We got it's Mike Nutter like joining us. Just like walk now. up and just butt in. Right? Yeah, I was minding my own business. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh boy, oh boy. What are you having fun? Me? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yes. I mean, this this show is a. It's quite a circus. Yes. It, it is. Everybody's been really happy though. Yeah. I, thre yeah. I threatened people earlier that, that were in line that looked very tired and I said we were going to do like a forced sing-along and they all started laughing and then somebody actually like started volunteered singing. a song oh, so it's like oh crap now we got to do it. Now we got to sing. <laughs> oh. 
yeah, it's been great energy. Everybody's so happy. Everybody's getting ready for workshops that they're getting ready to go to, coming back from them really excited, buying products that their instructors recommended that they get to try. Fantastic. And I've met all sorts of viewers. It's just been wonderful. Yeah, me too. Yeah, isn't really it crazy? Special. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. I've, I already noticed that I popped up in the Jerry's Facebook Live group. Oh, I was really? like, oh, wow, wow, she posted that like right that then. Quick. Yeah, so so it's pretty fun. Oh, now, is this the only thing you're demoing? This, this is, no, Sergeant? this is what I'm doing today. Ah, right. The next two days is going to be the pouring painting. Okay. So I get to have fun, get messy, yes. laugh. We should do that together. We should. Yeah. We should do competitive pouring painting. Competitive pouring. Like, see who I can, can do You're the wrong. fastest competitive pour. Like, who can come up with the painting that uses the most colors the fastest? Right. I think we should do it. Okay. We, we can do it in film. Sure. Yeah. yeah. We yeah. have the staff. We, have we the do. Yeah, we can do that. We have the power. We have the technology. Yeah. And then you have another workshop tomorrow? I do have another workshop tomorrow yes. from 5 to 8. What what is that one on? It is expressionistic farm animals. Oh, that's, well, that's right. I read about that. That's yeah, cool. I know. I brought other pictures other than just cows. I'm letting animals. them go wild. There's all sorts of stuff. I even put barn owls in there. Because, oh, you know, yeah. find those on a farm. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. All right, well, we are going to go see what Ophelia's demoing. Yes. She's right here. Anything else you want to say? To uh, no, just if you're in the area or you're looking for something to do this weekend and you're, you know, in North Carolina, South Carolina, Virginia, it's not that far a drive. It's so fun. Everybody has been just going nuts about the prices, saying that literally, like, they go out, they think about stuff they've already checked out, they're coming back in yeah, and getting it's less. mayhem. Like, yeah. several people have been through, the because the line has gone by, mm -hmm. like, multiple times, yes. and they're like... And then even a guy came in, probably about 30 tubes of Chardon, and then came back and was like, I thought about it, I'm just getting the other colors now. Ah, yeah. It's like, that's, yeah, as well. that's now, cool. So, the yeah. Price right. Exactly. So, yeah, it's just fun. Good times. Well, uh, yeah, if you want to hit down Ophelia, I think yeah. she's... She's over this way, so we're going to say right. goodbye to Amy for right. now. We will see you later see this you weekend, guys. though. Yep. And let's go find Ophelia. Have fun. Are you ready to go kind of get along? All right. So that's just a little taste of some of the demoing that goes on. And you see, it's very hands-on, and it's multiple products. So if you're really not sure about this brush or this brush, come down, give it a try. There's no problem picking something up and testing it out yourself, and you'd be pleasantly surprised with what you can experience and get your hands dirty with. All right, so Ophelia is right over here. She's a little busy right now, so um, we'll see what she's demoing. See if she's ready for us. There she is. All right, you want to head around there? I'll come in and sneak into the booth. Do I need lipstick? No, you're beautiful. I saw a badge of honor. All right. Hey everyone, right. welcome to our special edition uh, of Mixed Media Monday. That's right. Some of you should know Ophelia from Mixed Media Monday on our YouTube channel. That is if correct. not, give it a check. Uh, check it out. It's usually every other Monday. Uh, we might miss this next coming Monday just because we're so busy here with AOC, but we'll get you in again Ophelia before the end injured. of the year. That is, that is correct. So we'll probably take a little break from mine. However, today we're just going to have a little bit of fun here at Bart of the Carolinas. Like so, you've been working with Lucas today? I, my favorites are, oh that's right, if you don't know my favorites, my Where have you been? favorites are, I've got my Jerry's Jumbo Jet Black Pencil, and my Lucas Acrylics, and I've literally just been playing with all sorts of everything all day long. The prices are incredible, so if you're in the area, just stop by. It's The energy here is just amazing. It's a lot of wheels here. It's a lot of fun. So if I walked up to you and said, hey, um, I'm interested in Lucas paints, but I'm not sold on them. What would you say? I would say you come right over here and try these for yourself. They're incredible, highly pigmented acrylic paints that work beautifully. They mix well. They do everything that I need them to do. Even my glasses are falling. No, you're beautiful. Even in my professional work, I like them because they're just good paints. They're just, and I would always invite anybody to just yes. come on over and try them for themselves. Well, could we get a quick little demo of something? You betcha. All Let's. Right. I'm just working on some heavyweight drawing paper. So I'm going to move this out of the way, and in 
perfect circumstances. Uh, you know what? I'm going to work on this. Because it's the magic of TV, right? Here we <laughs> of go. Of live TV. Of live TV. So I've got some acrylics poured out here. But then I also think it's kind of cool if I throw in some of these 12 shades of gray. That's right. And so I'm just going to put some colors out here. And my Jerry's Jumbo Jet Black. Am I in the way? No, you're good. You're good? Okay. My Jerry's Jumbo Jet Black. I like to use this first to just make myself some marks. Are you good? Okay. My base marks are down. I'm just going to take some paint because my favorite thing is that I love how this immediately turns gray. No brushes um, required. No, no. We do not do brushes here. We, we do Hands we off. do have brushes just this is a little more fun to do without brushes so it gives me a nice gray I guess this jumbo jet black pencil is an oil impregnated charcoal so I like that it mixes with a, a cool gray now I'm just gonna start playing with color and all I'm doing if, if you think about it this way like you're getting dressed on a Saturday night to go out somewhere fancy you will at first select your clothes so all i'm doing basically is covering this with some paint and then we'll come back later with a brush and put on our earrings or our jewelry okay can are, are we okay with that one yeah okay sweet because that's how i get ready on friday that's all i've got going right now is that we're just putting paint on the canvas and usually this is what I like to do to kind of warm up. I am just working on um, like a, a canvas panel. So I feel as though if I totally ruin it, there it's a canvas panel. But I just keep in mind that all I want to do is just kind of cover this. And I go, yep, good enough. I'm going to blend it precisely. And then I take my pencil. I'm dirty. I take my pencil and I come back in and just kind of give myself some marks. Uh huh. That and pencil really powers through the paints too. Yes, it does. Yes. I learned from the best. He, this is the you're the greatest. And yes, it does. I like the way that it does carve through the paint and kind of like digs in and makes texture for me. So now I would get myself a brush. Found one, stolen, and cleaning it. And now what I want to do is let this dry up a little bit. Yeah, we don't have a hair dryer. Though. We do not. But do I have no idea? All right. Now what I want to do is just put my jewelry on because I've got the clothes on as much as as I want to cover it. And I'm gonna take. A smaller brush because now it, I don't really need anything huge or large and I'm just gonna come in and add a few little details like let's keep in mind that this would be better if it's dry but we're busy here we've got a lot of things so I'm just gonna come in and oh, thank you and maybe I go here Feel like I need a little bit more. I, I want to. I keep changing my mind. I wonder what this would look like here. Oh, yep. Yeah, there. Okay. And then I almost want to wipe that off, but let's just go right over. All righty. No, I'm gonna leave it. Uh, it's a quick demo. I'm gonna leave it. But now. I'm just gonna come back in. Yeah, I've got brushes and palette knives here. Feel free to grab whatever you want. I have more colors back there. Oh, yeah. You can hear some of the other demos going on in all the booths. So it's not just Ophelia. Everywhere you go around here, there are hands-on things to do. There are. Now we're cooler. Yes, of course. Why would you not come to Ophelia? We are cooler, but it's it's like a ginormous party all over. So now, just hit a little bit of splatters, and we're going to call this done. Boom. 
instant fun right there. But it's, it's, we're going to call this done. So why does it take you two hours when you're in the studio with because us? Because Ming Just argues with me. Where's Ming? Ming argues. But it's simple. It's a warm-up. It's non-threatening. It's just you kind of playing around. And that's what I like to do. That's Art in action. Oh. A new show. I love it. Yep. Yes. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. Yeah. Um, any, are you doing more demos over the weekend? You're going to be here I all weekend? I will be here every day, today through Sunday. Tomorrow yes. I'll be here 8 to 5.30. Yeah, 8 to 5.30 is tomorrow's hours. Uh -huh. um, and Sunday I believe it's 10, 10 to, to 3. 3. 10 to 3. I'll and be there right are also here. workshops going on all day on Saturday and Sunday as well. There's still a few spots available. So go to artofthecarolinas.com to check that out and register if you want. Otherwise, just come down and say hello and play with some paint. Definitely. See you all guys. Right. See you guys. Uh, was that all? Yeah. That was, uh, was my hair okay? <laughs> <laughs>